Minister, what should have been um, a pro day in a nice state that this state recognises uh, the Palestinian state um, really has lost a lot of that with what happened on Sunday and the horrific atrocity and the war crimes carried out by the Astra uh, Israeli sta uh, state. Um, when you look at the photographs and the pictures and the videos that come from there, and you hear the screams of people, screaming, as the Israeli government burned men, women and children alive. They burned them alive. And the world stands by while 15,000 children are being slaughtered. 35,000 men and women are children. And um, it's unbelievable. The genocide that's happening, a child with no hate, a child with no hate, and the Israeli government say it's a mistake, a mistake. I hope that Benjamin Netanyahu burns in hell the same way them children and their families burned. I hope him and his generals and the fair right government in Israel, that when their God finally bring him to the resting place that he deserves to burn in hell. Because what is happening now, not alone is it apartheid, not alone is it atrocity and a war crime, it's just horrific. It's just horrific what they're doing. Where is their soul? Where is the soul of the Israeli people that allows their government to do this to children? Where is their humanity? The Israeli people, the Jewish people, after everything the Jewish people have suffered down over the decades, that they would allow their government to do this to other human beings. Human beings. But in the eyes of Netanyahu and this far right Israeli government, Palestinians are human beings. But today, here, the Irish people say, we recognise Palestine. We recognise that they are human beings, just like every one of us. Shame on Israel. Shame on what they've done and will never be forgotten.